the James Webb Telescope has simply declared the clearest picture of Proxima b in history, uncovering shocking insights concerning this possibly livable exoplanet. Join us as we set out on a venture through space to reveal the secrets of Proxima b and find out whether it very well may be the next Earth. We should take off into the tremendous region of space a puzzling planet exists in the habitable zone of its star, Proxima Centauri. This planet isn't just any ordinary stone, it's Earth's cousin. Proxima b, found a mere 4.2 light years from us, is covered in mystery and miracles. Might it at some point be another Earth, with seas and life overflowing on its surface? Yet wait, there's something else. Proxima b isn't the only one in its orbit around the red dwarf star, it has an individual voyager, Proxima Centauri c. Who can say what other secrets the star system holds? Maybe there's another companion that we have yet to discover. The mystery doesn't stop there. Proxima Centauri b receives roughly the same amount of energy from its star as Earth does from the Sun. Could this actually mean that there's water on its surface, maybe even life? As we adventure past our solar system, we find a totally different universe of exoplanets, planets that circle stars other than the Sun. With 200 billion stars in the universe, the possibilities of exoplanets are endless. Some exoplanets even wander aimlessly, untethered to any star, like rebel explorers in space. Among them all, Proxima Centauri b stands out as a truly remarkable and puzzling planet, with a year that lasts only 112 Earth days and a distance from its star that is multiple times closer than Earth is to the Sun. Almost certainly, one side of the planet is constantly washed in light, while the opposite side remains in endless darkness. Now we should discuss Proxima Centauri, the star that Proxima b circles. Proxima Centauri is part of the Alpha Centauri triple star system. This system includes Rigel Centaurus, otherwise known as Alpha Centauri a and b. Together, these stars make the closest star system to our own solar system. The two stars, Rigel Centaurus and Ptolemy, form the binary known as Alpha Centauri a and b. These G and K type stars appear as one star in the constellation Centaurus and are the third brightest stars in our night sky with a magnitude of 0.27. Proxima Centauri, otherwise known as Alpha Centauri C, is a red dwarf or M star found 0.21 light years from the other two stars multiple times the distance between Earth and the Sun. It is indeed the closest star to us. Proxima Centauri means the nearest star of Centaurus in Latin discovered in 1915 by Scottish astronomer Robert Thorburn Aiton Innes. Proxima Centauri remains invisible to the naked eye due to its apparent size of 11.13, which is far beyond the maximum human limit of 6.5. However, don't let that fool you Proxima Centauri is still a star worth marveling at. Red dwarf stars like Proxima Centauri are among the most efficient in terms of energy production. They may not produce a great deal of energy, but the internal convection process at their center keeps them shining for trillions of years. In fact, Proxima Centauri will remain a main sequence star for another four trillion years. Yet the habitability of a red dwarf star like Proxima Centauri is still being debated. For one thing, it's a flare star, meaning it has frequent and erratic fluctuations. As a low mass star, the habitable zone would be closer to it than that of the sun, projected to be somewhere between 0.23 and 0.54 AU. But it's not as habitable as it seems Proxima b probably won't have a stable atmosphere, which is essential for maintaining conditions suitable for liquid water on its surface. Without it, living organisms would be vulnerable to perilous space weather, making life nearly impossible. So while Proxima b might seem Earth-like on the surface, it's far from being able to support life. Many remain skeptical, as there are various factors that render it uninhabitable. The quest to uncover the truth about Proxima b continues, and some still hold hope. One instrument that has caught the attention of cosmologists is the James Webb Telescope. After various delays, the telescope was finally launched in 2018 and will help us determine if there is life on Proxima b. As with everything in science, things are never fully as clear as they seem. A multitude of changes were required to ensure that the James Webb Telescope produced accurate images. As Avi Loeb, a theoretical physicist at Harvard, explains, if a planet like Proxima b can absorb light from its star, it can also emit it as infrared light. The James Webb Telescope was specifically designed to detect infrared light. It can take photographs of this light on the surface of the planet and look for patterns that could confirm whether the planet has water or an atmosphere. 
But what if the planet has an atmosphere that isn't conducive to life? The presence of an atmosphere doesn't guarantee the presence of life, cautions Ed Turner, an astrophysicist at Princeton University. Proxima b could be like Venus, with a thick atmosphere that is multiple times denser than that of Earth, leading to extreme heat that would make it impossible for life to exist. The quest to unravel the mysteries of Proxima b isn't without its challenges. While the James Webb Telescope holds promise, there are other factors to consider. With costs mounting, astronomers are hard-pressed to figure out how to study planets like Proxima b. The risks are great, but the rewards are even greater the opportunity for a brief look into the unknown. To uncover the secrets of a distant planet that holds the promise of life is one that a serious researcher will take. Going to Proxima b, supposing speculatively the exoplanet is hospitable. Might we even go there? It's the closest exoplanet to us which makes it so exciting because it's almost like looking into our cosmic backyard. What's even more interesting is that it's roughly the same size as Earth. Moreover, its location in the habitable zone means it might actually have conditions for life as we know it. Proxima b's proximity also makes it a viable target for our quest for life beyond Earth. With it being just around the corner, well, somewhat it's a great candidate for interstellar missions. Imagine the chance of exploring this Earth-like exoplanet. However, we can't yet go there, but it's definitely on the radar for future missions as technology makes it more accessible. It's one of the most exciting prospects in the field of space exploration. However, it is no easy feat to get there. It would take 75,000 years for a spacecraft like Voyager 2 to reach the Proxima Centauri system. Nevertheless, a plan has been proposed solar sails. These ultra-thin sails could be used to accelerate a spacecraft to the Alpha Centauri system and Proxima along with it. This technology utilizes solar pressure to keep the spacecraft on course, eliminating the problem of running out of fuel. With anticipated speeds of 10% to 20% of the speed of light, the journey to the Alpha Centauri system could be reduced to just 20 years. The discovery of Proxima b has reignited humanity's interest in space exploration. The James Webb Telescope has given us a newfound sense of hope that we are not alone in the universe. This remarkable telescope is a wonder of modern technology with the ability to take us all the way back to the beginning of the universe, 13.7 billion years ago. A carefully guarded secret is that the farther away an object is, the longer it takes for light to reach us allowing the James Webb Telescope to view objects farther away than any telescope before it. In addition, it can observe these objects in longer wavelengths of infrared light, allowing us to see distant stars with unprecedented clarity. And what's even more exciting, this technology may illuminate the possibility of life on planets like Proxima b. However, as incredible as it is, there are limitations. For instance, an atmosphere on a planet doesn't guarantee life. Proxima b might be like Venus, with a thick, hot atmosphere uninhabitable for life. Yet, the James Webb Telescope can detect illumination as low as 5% brightness of the planet's day side enough to indicate bright orbital mirrors reflecting sunlight if an intelligent civilization were present. Our universe holds countless exoplanets, coming in diverse forms and sizes. Some resemble massive gas giants like Jupiter and Saturn, while others are Earth-like. Among them, gas giants, often called super-Jupiters, dwarf even the largest planets in our solar system and some orbit scorchingly close to their stars, earning the name hot Jupiters. Then there are the Neptunian exoplanets, similar in size to Neptune and Uranus, with some like hot Neptunes, positioned closer to their stars, making them challenging to study from afar. Terrestrial exoplanets resemble Earth in size, ranging from smaller to double our planet's size. With some classified as super-Earths, one fascinating example is Proxima Centauri b, a super-Earth with seven times Earth's mass, although it's too close to its star for a habitable environment. This system also includes Proxima Centauri c, discovered in 2020, which may be bright due to an apparent ring system. Another possible companion, Proxima Centauri d, detected by changes in the star's radial velocity, could be similar in size to Mercury or Mars. Imagine a universe teeming with stars and planets of unique compositions and orbits an endless array of possibilities.